me has me going, well, we build a new stadium, people will come. Players will want to play here. I just know it. If you build it, they will come. I saw that in a movie. What one. is that over there? Is that my ass or if I think that's a football bat? <laughs> the Cleveland Browns are awful. They're a deplorable team. And I watched them lose last night. I watched almost the entire game on Monday Night Football. And this team, when I say this team, I'm talking about the entire organization, from Jimmy Haslam all the way down to the water boy, on the ball boys and the sidelines, is deplorable. They're terrible. This is how bad the Cleveland Browns are. They're so bad, and their ownership is so horrible. Get this. Last week, after our win against the Ravens, Jimmy Haslam and his wife, Dee, Went on TV, said they're thinking about building a new stadium, a dome stadium. And if you're not from Cleveland, <clears throat> you gotta know that our current stadium is only 20 years old. <laughs> uh, and we've got a team that couldn't fight their way out of wet paper bag with a pair of uh, box cutters. I, I am, there's not words to say how bizarre this town is. And if you wanna know, how messed up and how backwards and how podunk Cleveland is. Just watch the Cleveland Browns on any given Sunday, and that is a microcosm of this weird hillbilly town we live in. So Cleveland is just dying. And and if you want to know about a dying Midwestern city, watch the Cleveland Browns. It is a microcosm of the city of Cleveland. The way the city is run, the way the, the infrastructure is, their attitude, their belief system, I mean... The Browns is just a bunch of hillbillies. They is just a bunch of hillbillies. They don't know, the coaches don't know how to coach, the players don't know how to play, and the owners don't know what they're doing. The owner is thinking of building a new stadium and we don't even have a team yet. The owner is thinking of building a new stadium and we don't even have a team yet. I just, you just can't even begin to understand the insanity of that. Let me say this again, we've got a team it has won no more than like nine games in three or four years. And they're thinking of building a new stadium. The stadium is only 20 years old, people. The, the owner, the hillbilly owner of the Cleveland Browns is thinking of building a new stadium. They can't even fill the one they've got. And if they don't have a winning record this year, no one's gonna come out to see them next year. Who's gonna come to a dome stadium in that godforsaken Green Lake? in the middle of the winter to watch a team that doesn't know it's ass from a hole in the ground. I mean, this team is terrible. I thought my eighth grade football team was bad. They're worse than my eighth grade football team. This team is terrible. You may as well have, who coached my eighth grade football team? The assistant principal of the school and my eighth grade English teacher. <laughs> and, and I didn't know what the other guy did. He was the track coach, but I don't know if he taught anything. He probably taught social studies or something. This team, the Browns, is so bad from top to bottom, inside and out, that they're considering building a new stadium. I guess I guess Jimmy Haslam goes, well, we build a new stadium. People will come. Players will want to play here. I just know it. If you build it, they will come. I saw that in a movie once. Is that right, D? D Haslam is my wife, and she is my backbone. She is my, she's my savior, man. Oh, she told me to build a new stadium, so I'll build a new stadium. Cause me and D, we're like that. We're like freaking frack. We're like peanut butter and jelly. Oh, I bought myself a football team, cause I got lots of money. I got lots of money, and I like to build football teams. And, and build stadiums for teams that can't even win a game. Isn't that brilliant, D? Uh-huh, D agrees with me. G knows how smart I am. <laughs> I'm gonna go pump me some gas now with with Freddie Kitchens. Hey, Freddie, you got your straw hat and your jaw? We're gonna go pump us some gas. <laughs> Let's go build a new stadium for a team that can't even play no high football. We don't know how to play football. I'm gonna build ourselves a team and a stadium down by the lake. Oh, Lord, that's a good idea. <laughs> uh, I'm Jimmy Haslam. Bye-bye.